What is up guys? It's your boy Rondo back here for another video and uh, I just felt like talking about the NBA champions, the Denver Nuggets as if, if, if you watch basketball, you know this was their first ever championship win in franchise history. Big old W, right? Big W, right? Um, And, and Nikola Jokic, man, you, you did amazing, bro, but basically I'm going to be reacting to clips and, uh, you know, little interview bits and some of these I've seen, some of these I didn't see, but it is hilarious, man. This this man, Nikola Jokic, he just treated this shit as like another day, man. It is hilarious. Like this man treated this shit like like it was another fucking day on a job, like <laughs> like like he was clocking in and clocking out. So right here, I mean, yeah, he's just enjoying his little his little shits in 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 Denver. You know what I mean? The you know the parade or whatever, right? So I'm curious what you are feeling right now, and if you're looking for. So right here, we're gonna look at a clip. We're gonna look at a clip of him in a little interview bit. So I'm curious what you are feeling right now, and if you're looking forward to a parade coming up in Denver. When is parade? <laughs> when is parade? Thursday. No. <laughs> I need to go home. <laughs> <laughs> See what okay. I mean? He doesn't give a fuck. He just wants uh, to go home. So I'm curious. He just, he just wants to go home, bro. This, bro, this man does not give a shit. But you can see, like, the day after, you know, whenever he did go on a parade, he was clearly enjoying it. Clearly. You can see he's with his family. You know? He seemed happy. So I'm... Uh, you know that I, I told that uh, I don't want to stay on parade, but I fucking want to stay on parade. This is the best. <laughs> fucking, fucking oh, man. Uh, this, is, this is amazing. This Look at is, that. Uh, if you're all gonna remember this the, our whole lives. And if you're looking forward Sheesh. to a parade coming up in Denver. Look at that, look at that. A whole Men's clip. Parade. He didn't want to go to Men's the parade. parade. If it Thursday. during the parade, he wanted no. to fucking stay. I need to go home. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, man. Seeing the way this man has done his interviews and the way he's talked, I find him to be one of the most interesting NBA players because in my head, you see a lot of these uh, players, you know, and, and anywhere you look, you know, in sports it's usually highly driven not to say he's not highly driven but you know they're just driven because they might love the sport or they're just highly competitive but the way this man talks about the sport and the way he makes it sound like another nine to five job to me it just feels like he was just clocking in and just trying to get the job done you know even in another interview clip he was talking about like how he got the job done he just wants to go home i don't know if i can find that but mad respect though, he's showing, he's shaking everybody's hands and, and shit. Now you are an NBA champion, Nicola. How oh, this is that feel? first interview clip I seen the other day. The job is done, we can go home now. I'm curious what literally. you are feeling right now. Literally, see, see what I mean? The job is done, he just wants to go home. He just literally wants to, apparently his dream job isn't even the NBA. Apparently it has something to do with fucking racing horses. And I was like, holy shit, really? Uh, we won it. <laughs> But I think it's not the most important thing in the world still. Uh, there is a bunch of things that uh, that I like, that I like to <laughs> do. I mean, probably that's no, that's a normal thing, you know. Nobody likes his, uh, his job or <laughs> maybe I mean? they do. They're lying. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he said nobody likes a job, maybe they do. They're lying. So it makes me think, bro, like, oh, oh, my God, his perspective is just so unique to me, you know what I mean? Because the reason I do YouTube, you know, the reason I have two channels that I try to upload on, even if it's shitty quality sometimes, you know, I get mad at myself for that. But I, I really do try to upload because it's something I enjoy doing. And sometimes my day really just doesn't feel complete without uploading a YouTube video, you know what I mean? And... It's definitely something I want to do. It's definitely something I enjoy doing. You know what I mean? And to think that this man did basketball, not not because he enjoyed doing it or whatever, but because he wanted to succeed and because he needed a job. Let's just per, just per se. You know what I mean? He just needed money. He needed to make money. And this was his, his way of doing it. It's just an interesting perspective. It's like me, I'm doing YouTube, right? But if I look to other reasons why I'm doing YouTube is because I want to succeed and I want to make some really good fucking money. I feel like he's just saying what most people would say regardless of, you know, what kind of job they are, or, you know, they have. Yes, yeah, somebody might have your dream job, like be an entertainer, movie star, or, or a fucking YouTuber, or a fucking music artist, rapper, singer, or you know, professional sport play, sports player. Uh, at the end of the day, it's, it, is it is a job. You know, it is a job. You got to get it done. If you don't get it done, it's not going to be good for you. 
I don't know, man. I, I just really wanted to see some of these clips because, like, it really does keep you humble, too. And he says even this is not the most important thing to him, you know. And it's for him, is really his family, you know, and being able to spend time with his family and his kids. Or I think he just has one kid right now. But, nah, man, it's just it's very unique. Very unique. They were enjoying it. Yeah, they were enjoying it. I don't know if you guys seen. Uh, I think I think Jokic has like another pair of brothers, like two two other brothers, and they call them the Jokic brothers. I think they were carrying a coach together. I don't know. These are some big dudes, man. Like th these guys are tall, man. Dude. And they were making fun of uh, Nikola Jokic because I think you know he's he, he looks out of shape. You know what I mean? He can't really jump like that. But look, this man just helped lead his team to a fucking championship. He was drafted. During a fucking Taco Bell commercial, from what I've heard. And that just astounds me. Nobody really, you know, seen him as a top prospect. And now look at him. This is, this is horrible quality. Jesus Christ. 720 is the high. Even if I put it on 1080, it still looks like shit. I bet. Hold on. Paul, yeah, that's, that's dog shit, dude. Even, even people are coming back to this video just to look. Just a fucking look, okay? And now he's an NBA Finals MVP. Yeah, man. Yeah. Now he's going to the NBA Finals. What a journey. <laughs> this is hilarious. During a Taco Bell commercial. It was LeBron's Taco Bell commercial? Stop playing. And in his stop. Stop playing. The next. State Farm agents never. We won't keep skipping, bro. I was about to say. Delicious. In a quesarito. Oh, it was during a quesarito commercial? This oh, is look. late. Oh, he literally did get drafted. He literally did get drafted after the commercial. <laughs> What do you guys think about this? Um, about Nikola Jokic's unique perspective? I just see it as interesting because you know most people when we when we look at basketball players, you know, or somebody who's passionate about their job, like uh, Kobe Bryant, you know what I mean? LeBron. It's not that they didn't do it for money, but it's because they were very, very extremely highly motivated and wanted to be the best basketball player. You know what I mean? But I look at Nikola Jokic. I don't think he sees himself wanting to be the best basketball player, but what he sees is being able to beat everybody. I don't even know how to explain it, bro. I have no idea how to explain it. Like, dude, this it's a 9 to 5. Yeah, there's no, yeah, it's a 9 to 5. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Drop a like, subscribe. Um, Nikola Jokic, bro. Congrats, man. You fucking did it for your team, bro. I wonder who the next year's NBA champions are going to be. Um, don't let it be a team that has already won many championships. I was glad Nuggets got it. I'm not even going to lie. As much as I wanted the Heat to win, the fact that Nuggets got it, good on you guys. First NBA championship for that franchise. You know, it's it's cool. It's cool to see. Other than that, uh, shit. Catch on the next one. Shit. I guess I got a clock out of my job now. Peace.